On June 4, 2025, the Swedish Defense Material Administration finalized a landmark agreement with Lockheed Martin, a leading U.S. defense contractor, to acquire the TPY-4 Next Generation Ground-Based Air Surveillance Radar. Valued at approximately 1 billion Swedish crowns, or over $104 million, this deal positions Sweden as the third nation to adopt this fifth-generation radar platform, following the United States and Norway. With deliveries scheduled to begin in 2027, the TPY-4 will replace the aging PS-861 radar system, significantly enhancing the Swedish Air Force's long-range surveillance capabilities. This strategic acquisition underscores Sweden's commitment to modernizing its air defense infrastructure and deepening its integration into NATO's collective defense framework, a critical move amid rising geopolitical tensions in the Baltic region and beyond. The TPY-4, a state-of-the-art radar with an active electronically scanned array, is designed to operate in highly contested electromagnetic environments. Its fully digital, software-defined architecture enables rapid adaptation to emerging threats, ensuring operational relevance in an era of increasingly sophisticated aerial challenges. Capable of detecting and tracking a diverse range of targets, including ballistic missiles, cruise missiles, stealth aircraft, and unmanned aerial vehicles. The TPY-4 offers a detection range of up to 1,000 kilometers in non-rotating mode and 555 kilometers in rotating mode. Its 360 degrees coverage, combined with advanced beamforming and low latency processing, allows simultaneous tracking of hundreds of targets across a vertical battle space spanning from below 30 meters above ground level to over 30,000 meters above mean sea level. The radar's robust resistance to jamming and electronic countermeasures ensures reliable performance under adverse conditions, making it a cornerstone of Sweden's air defense modernization. Sweden's decision to procure the TPY-4 comes at a pivotal moment in its defense strategy. Following its formal accession to NATO in 2024, Sweden has prioritized aligning its military capabilities with the alliance's standard enhance interoperability and contribute to regional security. The Baltic Sea region, a strategic hotspot due to its proximity to Russia and increasing militarization, demands advanced early warning systems to counter potential threats such as hypersonic missiles, low observable aircraft, and drone swarms. The TPY-4's modular, open systems design facilitates seamless integration with NATO's integrated air and missile defense networks, enabling Sweden to share real-time situational awareness with allies and coordinate joint responses. This interoperability is vital for collective defense operations, particularly in scenarios involving multi-domain threats that require rapid, synchronized decision-making. The TPY-4's technical capabilities set it apart from other radar systems in the global market. Its AESA technology provides unparalleled precision with a fast refresh rate and wide elevation scan that ensure continuous monitoring of the airspace, even in severe weather or electronic warfare conditions. The radar's automatic target recognition and classification capabilities distinguish between fast jets, rotary wing aircraft, UAVs, and missile trajectories with high fidelity, reducing operator workload and enhancing decision-making accuracy. In combat scenarios, the TPY-4 serves as both a primary long-range early warning radar and a high-tier node in an IMD network, supplying precision tracking data to surface-to-air missile systems, such as the Patriot or NASAMS which are widely used by NATO allies. Its mobility options, including fixed site and transportable configurations on tactical trailers, offer Sweden the flexibility to deploy the radar in diverse operational contexts, from static national defense to forward operating missions in support of NATO exercises. When compared to European alternatives like the Thales Groundmaster 400 Alpha and Saab Giraffe 4A, the TPY-4 demonstrates superior performance in several key areas. The Groundmaster 400 Alpha, known for its rapid deployment and mobility, excels in tactical scenarios but lacks the TPY-4's extended detection range and altitude coverage. 
The Saab Giraffe 4A, a versatile multi-role radar, offers robust performance for short to medium range applications, but falls short of the TPY-4's strategic surveillance capabilities and advanced digital processing. The TPY-4's ability to counter stealth, hypersonic, and saturation attack profiles, combined with its layered waveform control and resilient tracking continuity, makes it uniquely suited for Sweden's needs. Additionally, its digital backend supports on-the-fly software upgrades, allowing the system to evolve without costly hardware overhauls, a feature that ensures long-term cost-effectiveness and adaptability to future threats. The acquisition of the TPY-4 also reflects Sweden's broader defense modernization efforts. In recent years, Sweden has increased defense spending and prioritized investments in advanced technologies to address the evolving threat landscape. The TPY-4's deployment will enhance Sweden's ability to monitor its airspace, particularly in the strategically critical Baltic Sea region, where tensions have escalated due to Russia's aggressive posturing and the proliferation of advanced weaponry. By integrating the TPY-4 into its air defense architecture, Sweden strengthens its role as a reliable NATO partner capable of contributing high-fidelity sensor data to allied operations. This capability is particularly important for joint exercises and contingency planning, where shared situational awareness is essential for deterring potential aggressors and ensuring rapid response to crises. Furthermore, the TPY-4's selection highlights Lockheed Martin's growing influence in the European defense market. Unlike Norway's TPY-4 contract, which included collaboration with Kongsberg Defense and Aerospace for local industry involvement, Sweden's deal does not mention technology transfers or domestic partnerships. However, the agreement reinforces Lockheed Martin's reputation for delivering combat-tested, future-proof systems that meet the rigorous demands of modern warfare. The TPY-4 has proven track record in the U.S. and Norway combined with its advanced engineering, positions it as a cornerstone of NATO-aligned air defense operations, with potential for further adoption by other alliance members. The strategic implications of Sweden's TPY-4 acquisition extend beyond national borders. As NATO strengthens its eastern flank, the radar's ability to provide persistent, high-resolution surveillance enhances the alliance's collective situational awareness particularly in the Baltic region. Its compatibility with existing NATO systems ensures that Sweden can seamlessly contribute to multinational operations, from air policing missions to missile defense exercises. Moreover, the TPY-4's ability to detect low radar cross-section targets and counter electronic warfare threats addresses critical vulnerabilities in modern air defense, making it a vital asset for deterring advanced adversaries.